We introduce the new generation spot inspection device Matrix I6, proposed by Toshiba Inspection Solutions Company. Matrix I6 is an ultrasonic testing equipment equipped with software dedicated to spot inspection. Not only the inspection quality has been greatly improved from conventional inspection systems, but it also has added new functions such as sensitivity adjustment and monitoring shoe wear condition. In this video, we will see the actual inspection process using Matrix I6. In the first chapter, we start the equipment and set up the initial settings for inspection. At first, connect the necessary equipment for inspection. Testing with Matrix I6 requires an ultrasonic Pro, AC power supply or battery connection. Also, connect the mouse, keyboard, hand switch, etc. as needed. When we turn on the front switch of the Matrix I6, the equipment starts up and the screen come up automatically. Then, the first thing to is to register the operator. Click on the M mark in the upper left corner of the screen and select Login. Matrix I accounts include an administrator account with full access rights, and a general account with limited access rights. General accounts is not allowed to access some functions such as inspection procedures, measurement condition settings, and inspection database. In addition, each account can be password protected, if necessary, it can protect each individual account. After the operator is registered, perform the daily inspection of the device. Click on the upper right corner, where it says Surface Position, to display the Surface Adjustment window. On this screen, you can perform three items of inspection. We can execute three items, by clicking Execute All at the bottom right. In this way, the daily inspection of the Matrix I6 is automated, and can be easily inspected. Finally, set the inspection target. Click WPDB at the bottom center of the screen. Select the product to be inspected, and then select from the beginning or continue. Matrix I6 has recorded the previous usage history of each WPDB, and allows us to resume from the previous interrupted point by selecting Continue. This completes the inspection preparation. Now let's check the actual inspection procedure. At first, apply the gel to the spot welding point to be inspected. Ultrasound is highly attenuated in the air, so it is necessary to remove the air layer with a gel. Click Start to start updating the screen. Place the probe on the spot welding point. Check the screen, and adjust the position and angle of the probe. To get the spot welding point to the center of the screen, move the probe back and forth, right and left. Next, fine-tune the probe angle to get the reflection horizontally and vertically against the surface of the screen. The probe posture, having a reflection horizontally and vertically is most accurate for inspection. Once the adjustment is completed enough, click Stop to confirm the inspection results. We inspect second spot welding point with remote control. By pressing the center S of the remote control, the inspection is started. Place the probe on the spot and inspect the same way as on the first spot. Adjust it so that the spot welding point comes to the center of the screen Next, fine-tune the probe angle to get the reflection horizontally and vertically against the surface of the screen. When the adjustment is completed, press the S button on the remote control again to confirm the result. 
using a remote control increases inspection. When all the spots registered in WPDB have been inspected, it will be confirmed whether to repeat the inspection from the beginning again. Select Yes to repeat, or No to complete the inspection or change the product. This is the end of the inspection. This section describes how to check the inspection data obtained in Chapter 2, Inspection. To check the inspected data, click Read Data in the upper right corner to start the data management software. In the data management software, a list of acquired data is displayed. By using various sorting functions, we can check the daily variation of inspection results. In addition, this software can also be operated on a general Windows PC, so data can be organized on the desk. Finally, we will introduce the inspection using the simple measurement mode. In the simple measurement mode, inspection can be performed without inputting WPDB or plate thickness information. To change to simple measurement mode, click on the yellow circle mark at the top. Since there is no need to input thickness information or set up the WPDB, inspection can be performed in this state. This time, the inspection is performed using the hand switch. The hand switch is a device that allows the user to start and stop measurement with one hand. Measurement can be started by pressing the black button on the hand switch. Adjust the position and angle in the same way as the inspection using WPDB. After adjusting the position and angle, press the black button again. In the simple measurement mode, pass-fail judgment cannot be made but the measurement result can be confirmed in the same way as the inspection using WPDB. We're contributing to the Society of Safety and Security with Matrix I-6, ultrasonic testing equipment for spot welding, which has evolved further. Toshiba.